Hello there, God bless you. This is Pastor Prophet Johnson coming you alive from this wonderful city of Las Vegas. Hey, Apostle. Again, we're here at the Golden Corral Church of God in Christ. I got a question before you. <laughs> when is a sinner forgiving of his or her sin? When does a sinner get forgiveness of their sins? A, before death, or B, after death? The, re the question is very obvious. A person cannot ask for forgiveness after they have died. But it's so unfortunate that we got the unsaved, the uneducated, the unchurched, the wicked trying to teach the saints the things of God. And it is sad when the, the saints allow or try to allow the sinner, the unsaved, the unregenerated, the reprobate to try to instruct them in the things of God. If a person die without Jesus, they go straight to hell. It's not about God's forgiveness at that point. If a person die on their deathbed, in their sins, if a person die in an automobile accident, if a person die naturally without knowing who Jesus is, it's not about God's forgiveness anymore. God, God is out of God's hands. Did you hear that? I said, it's out of God's hands. If you die in your sins, it is out of God's hands. It is too late for you. Hebrew 9, 27. It is appointed unto man once to die, and after this, after the judgment, after death is the judgment. It is out of God's hand. It is out of God's control. You have decided your fate. You decided to live a life without Jesus. You decided to die in your sins, and that's just how you, unfortunately, you die. So it is so unfortunate that sinners are trying to teach the saints what the scriptures say. Leave it just like it is. Saints, don't be intimidated. Do not be intimidated. Do not compromise the truth of scripture. Do not compromise with the, with the sinner. Do not let the devil cause you to compromise. If you compromise with the unsaved, we can head out now. We allow and encourage that unsaved individual to go to hell. Sweetheart, did you want these? If you, if you compromise with the sinner, you encourage that sinner to go to hell. You're not being nice. You're not being kind. You're encouraging that precious soul. Love you, man. God, appreciate it. Young lady. If you compromise with that sinner, you're allowing and encouraging that sinner to go to a place called hell. And it's not a joke. So speak the truth in love. Speak the truth in love. Love you, my brother. God bless you, man. Young lady, thank you now. Brother, brother. Thank you. God bless y'all now. Speak the truth in love. It's, it's sad. When, when pastors and leaders trying to be nicer than Jesus. <laughs> Amen. You know not the scripture nor the power of God, Jesus said. You know not the scripture nor the power of God. And how is it you going to teach Jesus? He, go, he is the word. How are you going to teach the word about the word? How you doing? God bless you now right away. Yes, sir. How are you going to try to teach the word about the word? He is the word. Huh? Yeah. He is the word. So again, does a sinner get forgiveness before death? Or does the sinner get forgiveness after death? Hallelujah. And if you wanna if you wanna get right with God, how you doing, young man? Nice to see you again. Yes, sir. Love you, man. What's up, brother? God bless you. So a sinner gets forgiveness before death. Don't wait until you die, then God gonna be merciful to you. It, listen, once you die, it, whether you go to heaven or hell is out of God's hand. Did you hear what I just said? Once you die, whether you go to heaven or hell, it is out of God's hand. You have sealed your own fate. Let me push this over to the side here. It's all good. Take your time. Thank you. Did you hear that? Once you die, whether you go to heaven or hell, it's out of God's hand. You have sealed 
your own fate. So our encouragement is for you to make your election and your calling sure. Say yes to Jesus right now. Well, Lord, you're not going to stand before the great white throne judgment and ask for mercy. God doesn't hear the prayer of the of the dead. To, to prove that in the book of St. Luke, in the book of St. Luke, chapter uh, 16, start at verse 19, right down to verse 31. There's a man in hell praying. His pr it's in your Bible. St. Luke, chapter 16, start at verse 19. There's a man in hell praying. His prayer is not answered in hell. hell hell's prayers are not answered. Walk in love. Speak the truth in love. Amen.